trying to put on clean, dry socks when your legs look like this. Um, it feels a little pointless, but we're going to do it because we like dry feet for maybe like five minutes because I think that's about how long they're going to stay dry today. <clears throat> Getting ready to roll. <laughs> Literally roll. Uh, <laughs> day 31. It is still raining. still raining, but um, we are pushing to hot springs, if I didn't say that already. Um, so we can have a warm bed and a warm shower because storms are coming tomorrow. So it's going to be a nice little zero. It was beautiful all night. didn't rain until about 6.15 this morning. <laughs> and the, and and the, the universe the, was like, wake up. The rain, the rain said, hey, I heard you wanted to pack up your wet tent this morning for the first time. I said, your tent's so dry. Let me fix that. Let me fix that. Mm. And we had a bad pitch, so we slid down all night and the foot box of our quilt was actually touching the inner and the inner was touching the outer, so our quilt got a little wet. So that sucks, but it's okay. We're not sleeping with it tonight, so we can dry it out. Ready to roll? I am ready to roll. All right. Yes. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear that, but this uh, stream down below us is absolutely ripping. It's one of the cool things about some rain out here is all the water sources get replenished and uh, all the little water crossings are really pretty, little waterfalls and stuff. Okay, silver linings. So Chuck just had his, I feel like a through hiker moment. Now I feel like a through hiker. We left camp and started hauling butt and he caught a signal so we wanted to secure a place to stay at hot springs so probably doing our fastest hour yet in the rain in the slippery mud he's not using his poles and he's on the phone trying to secure a, a bed at a hostel so he finally had his yeah i'm a through hiker moment <laughs> love that for you <laughs> and love it for us because we got a bed at laughing heart so I'm excited for a zero after two very soggy days. I'll be excited to be dry. And I think we have a private bathtub. So I'm gonna be buying some Epsom salt and just soaking my bones. I'm very excited. So it stopped raining, but now we're in, in the fog. No views, just fog. <laughs> So this is right off trail. Wow, 1882. Wow, that's crazy. Let's see if I can. Wow. So we're finally beginning our climb down into hot springs. Both of our feet are feeling it today. We had three pretty high mileage days back to back to back. So very much looking forward to this zero. And also looking forward to the fact that uh, the trail goes straight through town. And this is the first town, if you're Nobo, that the trail just cuts straight through. So that's kind of exciting. 
and cool. You can start to see it a little bit in here through the trees on this walk down. I hear cars. It's all very exciting. We're so close. We're less than a mile away from the hostel. Thank God. So there it is down in the trees. We'll be there very shortly. So we made it to Laughing Heart Lodge and our spirits were immediately lifted because all of our friends are here. We're so excited. Our friends are here. We're taking a big fat zero tomorrow. And we might go get Mexican food tonight, so. Also, I heard something about karaoke. Karaoke. Yes. It's gonna be a good night, you guys. Stepping out on the town in the loners. Fit check. <laughs> So we're on the lodge side of Laughing, Laughing Heart, Laughing Heart. Um, way different vibes from Hostel, <laughs> but it's cool because you can just walk over to the Hostel and like you know do all the hiker things and all that, and hop back over to the lodge and have a nice peaceful, quiet evening. We're gonna hop over this guardrail here so we don't get hit by a car. Oh God, yo. Okay, let's go.